What's up everybody, it's your boy Roger Federer and today I cooked up a beat which goes into the Ty Fontaine, Kochai's direction. Both recently dropped songs, um, Ty Fontaine dropped an album and Kochai's got this Lyrical Lemonade single maybe like two weeks ago and it super inspired me to make these which go into that virtual direction so this is what I did today and I'll show you the whole creative process so we do the melody together and the drums of course but before we get into today's video I want everybody who haven't subscribed yet to hit that subscribe button and follow my social media accounts spring 040 on Twitter and Instagram you can find the link in the description as well and now let's don't waste any time and get straight into today's video I forgot to record the melody making process but it's not that complex so I will show you every single component real quick you got this main synth chord progression which is super easy I will play for you real quick so you can listen what it sounds like but it's not that uh, difficult to understand what I did here So then we got this synth lead on top from Electra X. The MIDI is super simple as well, as you can see. Uh, this is what both components sound like together. And last but not least, we got another synth right here. Simple MIDI as well. Uh, this is what every component sound like together. And for the effects, I uh, just um, did some chorus on that synth and some delay um, just to make it a little bit more moving. And for the other two components, I did nothing um, super simple. I think we can now go straight to the drums. These beats are super simple, but I like to produce them and makes a lot of fun. Um, this will probably be a short video. The most um, important thing is really the sound selection. One advice that I can give to you is look if there's anything missing in the component that you already have. Like as an example, if you got something which is in the mid frequencies, uh, look for a sound which maybe performs uh, more in the higher frequencies. These are just little things. If you got an outstanding component, just look for a sound for the background to don't let these sounds clash each other. This is the most important thing you need to focus on. Let's go straight into the drum making process. I'm super hyped to just throw in some simple drums to make this sound cool. Yeah, let's get it. I'll pitch it out one semitone uh, 
to because I don't want the 808 to be that low. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So that's pretty much the B super simple tutorial today. And now everybody that haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please hit that subscribe button and the like button to don't miss out any of my future videos. If you like my content and to support my channel, appreciate you all for the support and for watching of course. And I hope to see everybody in the next videos. I will play the B for you guys right now. I wish everybody a wonderful rest of the day. I'm out, peace.